It's been five years since the shooting death of Mobile police officer Sean Tudor, but this afternoon, the capital murder trial of his accused killer, Marco Perez, got underway. And of course, this is after weeks of jury selection. Let's go now to our Brendan Kirby, who's live at Government Plaza. Brendan, the stakes are very, very high. They couldn't be higher, Byron and Lenise. Prosecutors are seeking the death penalty in this case. It's expected to take weeks to present all the evidence. Today, both the prosecution and the defense playing the same video clip in their opening statements. It's surveillance video showing the physical confrontation between Officer Tudor and Perez just before the shooting at the Peach Place Inn Apartments on January 20th, 2019. But Prosecutor Ashley Rich and Defense Attorney Dennis Nisley had radically different interpretations of what it shows. Rich says that it shows Perez resisting arrest. She says that off camera, Perez shot Officer Tudor, and then when the gun jammed, ejected around, reloaded, and fired two more times. Nisley says that the video shows that his client was acting in self-defense. He says that Perez had no idea Tudor was a police officer. He says Tudor never announced himself as an officer. All Perez knew, he said, was that a man who's dressed in jeans and a hood was coming at him with a gun. Police had been looking for Perez, who is the subject of a federal warrant after he missed a meeting with his federal pretrial services officer. That was based on a federal gun charge. Officer Tudor had driven from his home in Daphne to the apartment complex that Sunday afternoon after getting a tip that Perez was there. He was in his private vehicle, whether Officer Tudor was on duty that night will be a crucial issue in this case. And the prosecution had time to call just its first witness today, a Mobile police officer who worked on that federal gun case. He's the first of what's expected to be dozens of witnesses. Reporting live from Government Plaza, Brendan Kirby, Fox 10 News.